Well, first of all, we were attracted by the fact that we were going to get access where no one else was, with Dr. Hawass. Seeing all the things that I've dreamt about since a child, I mean, I watched as a child the whole drama of this temple and the fact that it was going to be inundated by Lake Nasser. This was TV candy for me. Hard to believe this is a, a wonderful venue to be able to see among all of the venues that Archaeological Pass allows us to see. The diversity is out of this world. There is no other tour that would be similar to it. And there's some special things, some unexpected, wonderful things. You cannot miss the warmth of Mrs. Sadat. She's like your grandmother. She sits you down. If you talk to her, ask her about her cats. She has 11 rescue kitties. I mean, this is what we talked about. And last night in the village, that was pretty special. It's fabulous. There's so many different venues that I did not expect to be able to see. The tour altogether is well organized, uh, great people, very punctual about everything. Certainly, as they always say, a once in a lifetime experience. And not to be missed. Not, not to, be, to missed. be missed. You are shepherded through every single place. We get lots of helpful tips on how to deal with street vendors, aggressive and not so. By the end of the trip, you're pretty proficient at saying uh, no thank you in Arabic. And, and how do you do that? And you say la shukran. La shukran. He's the rock star of archaeology. He truly is. And I had brought a book that he had written for the exhibition of the treasures in 2005 in Los Angeles. He so kindly signed it. He was wonderful for his work shows through every word, every gesture. He's so emphatic about what he does and how he feels and what he's done for this country and for the world to save this civilization. We can't replace him. He tells it like it is, which is really great. He's very forthcoming, very easy to get to know, to talk to. We sat very close to him at dinner and had a great conversation with him. way exceeded expectations. I would do it again in a minute. Yeah. I mean, really, it's just really great. Every day has been full. I mean, we've had so much going on, just so many aspects of diversity in the tour itself, but in the Egyptian culture and the depth of Egyptian heritage. Speaking uh, of depths, depth. it's an adventure. <laughs>